Lord Frost has built up such support with Leavers and Brexiteers. He's now being urged by some Conservatives to stand in a by-election to become an MP and potentially a future Prime Minister. And so it's interesting to see Frost's latest comments uh, highlighting a Foreign Office uh, source quote, saying it is not sustainable for the EU Commission simply to refuse any kind of negotiation on the protocol, pointing out Northern Ireland is not part of the EU. HMG is the government of Northern Ireland and will need to act if the EU won't. Now, we wait to see what exactly the British government are going to do, but just to give you what the Foreign Office source is saying there in the Sunday Times, saying it's incredibly disheartening that despite the political and economic damage the protocol is causing in Northern Ireland, the Commission continue to adopt such a rigid and hardline negotiating position. So in the Belfast Good Friday Agreement is being undermined and the situation is now very serious. Both the PM and the Foreign Secretary have always been clear that action will be taken if solutions can't be found. The Assembly elections are now over and we need to see the EU move significantly. Our focus has been and will continue to be preserving peace and stability in Northern Ireland. The Deputy Prime Minister Dominic Ra was on Sky News today as well uh, talking about the Northern Ireland Protocol saying action on this cannot be put off. As for Brussels, it does appear now that they are expecting the UK to take unilateral action on this, at telling politics home there would be measured response if the government takes action on this. But I think uh, Frost's comment there, Frost's intervention there, shows you how urgent this situation now is. The British government need to stop talking and take action on this as ever guys i'll keep bringing you all the very latest you let me know what you make of this in the comments below if you want to support my channel do hit the thanks button to give a super thanks and of course as ever thanks for watching